Okay. Hello, hello. Time to continue with Tactical Final Fantasy. It is time to make progress. I haven't had a lot of time the past couple of days to do any type of uh, build up for the team. But I do want to make progress. Progress tonight. And it we're going to continue with the main story. Finally. In a little while. Anyway. We have to go to... Zeltenia. So, let's just dive right into it. I tried to work on... Um, Beowulf a little bit, but I haven't had much time to... Play the game since the last time I streamed, so... I... Just managed to get the JP boost for him. That's it. That's all I've been able to do. I did a couple quick fights before I started, and that, that's all I've been able to do. So, anyway, we'll just move on and see what comes. Whatever comes, what may, or whatever this saying is. Let's play the game. Okay, I don't know who I'm up against here. This is kind of a mystery. I'll bring Mr. Beowulf along because we want to work on building him up anyway. And we'll have a boost audio with me. Agrius can be over here. A lot of a wide area here. And who else should we have? No, I'm not going to bring the calculator. Raph and Mark still kind of suck, so let's, let's, let's bring the robot. Robot. I have no idea what this fight is. <laughs> I only have an inkling that we go to Zeltenia, then we go to Besselat afterwards. And I have, I don't know what happens. So I'm just... Oh, it's a bunch of chocobos. These waters are deeper than I thought. A single misstep could spell disaster. Or a single chocobo pet could spell disaster. Oh god, there's like... Two of the red chocobos. They can do like that choco meteor thing, which does like a lot of damage. Like that. Surprisingly enough, you know, chocobos are one of the more annoying enemies to fight in this game because they have great range, they can do decent damage, and they can heal. Depending on which chocobo you're up against. So. Yeah, they're quite, they're quite a bother to deal with. Reflexes. The reflexes do nothing. I really want to get rid of the red chocobos first, because they are bastards. Mm, Beowulf, you can do disable, that would be great. That would be a big benefit. Yes, get rid of one of them. Just takes one of them out of action for a moment.
I need to heal. I need to heal Ramza a little bit here. And robot. Smash. Yeah. <laughs> Overruns. I really need to put auto potion on Ramza. I don't know. I, I have no idea what reflexes even does. I don't even. I think. I don't think I've even seen it like do anything. Like I need to go back to using first strike or auto potion. You know what? Attack. Attack attack is always good. We will defeat these chocobos. We shall be defeated. They shall be disposed of. Was believed in. Was it a stripper? Yeah, sure, whatever. Give it a shot. Ew. 
I seem to remember back in back in the days that that particular fight was more challenging than I all to be. Well, I, well, it felt like it was harder back in the past when I played that mission. Maybe, maybe it's because I have the robot with me. The robot's pretty powerful. <laughs> it, it is strong. First strike now, finally. Let's see. I don't think Mustadio really needs to learn first strike. Because he's gonna be more of a ranged fighter anyway, so I'm tempted to put him back as an archer. Just so he can use his snipe skills. I wonder if there's anything else that would be good for him. Geomancer. And then I'm probably gonna make him an archer. Archer up from. No, no, put make him archer. Passing it, but yeah, I'll just do that. Oh, yeah, I do have that Artemis bow. Make use of that. Hmm. I almost kind of want to give him items. You know what? I think that's what I'm gonna do. Give him items. That would be more useful. And Gaia gear. Alright. And Agrius. I think we might put her back as a holy knight. Yeah, let's, let's just make her... I'm just going to make her Holy Knight for now. Give her the Defender. And... Safe card, because we don't want to risk losing that sword I gave her. <laughs> Auto Potion, and... What else should I give her? Martial Arts. That's always good to have. And... Put, yeah. Auto Potion on Ranza here. Because Reflexes doesn't seem to do anything. And I think we should be... Set. Okay. Alright, Zeltania. A heretic at prayer in a church. Asking bold, Manza. I shall ask it plain. Why has the High Confessor planted you amongst Goltana's men? I see no harm in telling you. Duke Goltana and Count Orlando. I aim to assassinate them. What? Groups such as the Corpse Brigade. Ill contented with the crown and, and the nobility, are in no short supply. The church only fans rebellion's flame. 
The people tire of war, and their disdain for the crown waxes with each passing day. Of course, Goltana and Laura want to put down the rebellions at home. Only they lack the troops to do so. They break the impasse. They seek to bring an end to the conflict for good and all. Even as we speak, their armies mass at Fort Besalak to that purpose. In these months of rebellion and unrest, it all goes as the High Confessor had planned. Yes, but it will not end as they have, have hoped. Larg and Goltana will be assassinated once the battle begins. Cut off one head, and two more spring forth. So naturally, their closest allies must die with them. Count Orlando of the Order of the Southern Sky, Zalbag of the Northern, and of course, Lord Dystarg. If their leader's gone, the fighting will cease, and they will have no choice but to embrace the peace we offer. A peace? Or surrender on the Church's terms? The people will proffer to the church for role of mediator with hands upraised. What's more, the church will have the zodiac braids. But there's the rub. The stones. One thing yet remains between the church and the Aurasite. The heretic Ramza Beovel. Is that it? You've come to fetch the Aurasite for your masters? I am no hound healing at the church's skirts. I answer to no one but myself. Meaning what? Meaning, I would not think twice of killing you, killing you, Ramza, should the hour come. But not this day. Though our methods be different, our goals are not. As long as they remain so, you are no enemy of mine. Alita, let us fight this together. I cannot join you. She needs me. Far too much to leave her now. The princess? Friends are princess, but church cares not. Braves only power. A puppet state with the High Confessor at its strings. This is their grand plan for Ivalice. And you? Do you not use Ovelia to fulfill your own ambitions? I cannot say. I am sure only of this. To save her life, I will gladly give my own. You must think this strange. No. I understand only too well. I too was once in love with a princess. I address the heretic, Remza Biavel. You are besieged. You will surrender yourself up to us at once. I know that voice. Confessor Zelmore. He's back. Okay, Agrius. Uh, I'm tempted to bring one of my ninjas with me. Just in case I have to steal stuff. And yeah, we'll bring uh, Beowulf. Beowulf! I think we also had De Delita assisting here as well. The Black Ram Knights delete a Hyrule. Yours is an unexpected sight. He has seen me. He must not live to tell of it. We must fight them, Ramza. They know nothing of the High Confessor's plot. They serve him blindly. If we explain what has happened, they may well listen. Hear your words, Ramza. Reasoning, reasoning with their ilk is folly. 
Even you must see this. But you have leave a tr lead to try. Or we'll just, you know, fight, fight them. Defeat Zamoa. I want to see if he has anything worth stealing. Okay, Ninja, you get that first. Or if anybody has anything worth stealing. Uh, no, he doesn't. Anybody else? No, oh, black robe. Hmm. Nothing all that valuable. The black robe is probably the most valuable thing I see so far. Maybe we can get that. Oh, this is one of those stages where you really should have, like, jump. Is kind of buff. What does he have on him? He has a rune blade. An embracer. Okay. Kaioken X1. Excellent. Can't move anywhere, though. What's the matter? You can't you can't do anything, Zalmore? You can't you can't do nothing? Affect his sword skills too. Oh, you're the one with the black hood. See if we can steal that. Yoink!
can't really do anything. He has a boo. Uh, excuse me, Delita, what the fuck was that? You traitor. Oh, apparently a spellblade kills skills are not muted. Okay, I can still do stuff. Enemies acting. Alright. Add something up, something to my something to my eye for a second there. I can't see. You and your items. You see, no one, maybe it's just put them on AI mode. Oh, we can hop up there. Okay. I can do Echo Herbs too. <laughs> Miss. Miss. Good. <laughs> You're immune to charms. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, I can't really. Nope. Can't throw anything from there. Do it, thou wilt. Leo, what, what, what the fuck are you doing? Stop attacking Ramza! <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> yeah, there's like nobody in range now. Who?
I think you should surrender, Zalmor. You're kind of surrounded now. Surrender now and I will spare your miserable life. Lita killed him, not me. I, I'm not I'm not the heretic responsible. Great Father, strike these sinners, that they may feel your wrath. Where will you go now, Ramza? Two errands brought me to Zeltenia. The first was to meet with you. The second is to speak with Count Orlando. The Thunder God? I mean to enlist, enlist his aid in exposing the church's intrigues. Plus I hear he's very off. How? I have powerful evidence of the church's misdeeds. The scriptures are Germanic. I spoke with the Count's adopted son, Orin, not long past. He pleads for age should I bring hard evidence against the church. Orin, eh? It's alright, she's with me. Milan has provided several others to help me carry out my task. He is but one. Maybe I should call it... Milande? Maybe I should call her Mulan Day, because if I call her Mulan, it sounds like the, the place, Mulan. Help you? I was sent to keep watch on you. And a fine job you're doing of it. Only she knows of our plans in full. I trust no one other in Goltana's army more. You're the youngest Baleville, Ramza, am I right? My name is... oh, her name's... <laughs> I was I thinking her name was Mulande? <laughs> Whoops. My name is Val Valmafra. Valmafra. Okay. Valmafra's her name. I take it you do not come for idle chat. The Northern Order moves. They make for for Besselat. Count Orlando himself has departed for the same only just now. Ukultana is like to join them soon, at the head of your Black Ram Knights, no less. Then we're too late. The fighting will continue. Do not give up yet. I might still convince the Count to avoid this needless bloodshed. Then our paths part once again. Be safe, Delita. And you, Ramza. Sorry about hitting you with my hollow bolt twice. It was an accident, I swear. You mean to let him go? He acts as I expected he would. Even your friends are only pieces to be played. Mind your words. You know not what you say.
such outbursts ill become a man. Haven't you somewhere else to be? Yes, yeah, so there's the sound of a bell. Zing, zing. Okay, our next objective is to get to Fort Basilet. Uh, but first, let's take a look at the shops. If there's anything good here. Nice brands. Mm, okay, nothing I don't already have. can do things, I swear. Oh, chicken. Chicken's a good thing to have. Engines. Uh, sleep would probably be good too. Let's get to sleep. You know what, I'm gonna give him white magic, because that might be a little bit more useful. Because he already has, like, oracle powers with the spell blade. I don't really need to double up on that. And, yep, yeah, okay, I think that's it. Alright, let's go this way. No, I'm not doing random fights in this stream. That is sand waste. <clears throat> okay. Yes, I mean Mr. Beowulf with me. Should I do two archers? Two ninjas. I'm gonna do two ninjas this time. Ninja! Ooh, ninjas. Oh, yes, this guy. Okay, good thing I brought the ninja ninjas with me. He has a gun I want. That's the last of it. The wind, the winds bear ill. Blah, blah, blah. I can't, I can't talk. The winds bear it onward now. And fair winds they are. They shall keep it airborne for half day if they hold. More than time enough. Now there is a creature I had not thought to find in these wastes. One might say the same of a knight templar so far from, far from the church. What, did, what is it you scatter to the wind? Oh, well, that? I suppose there's no harm in your knowing. There's naught you can do to stop it now. Stop what? This. It's called gunpowder. With poison. Poison? Yes, ground into a fine powder and cast upon the winds toward the northern sky. The toxin will not kill the men who breathe it, but it will wither their constitution, rendering them unable to fight. But why? The High Confessor stands to gain not by handing victory to Goltana. Nor does he think to. The moment Goltana hears of the Northern Order's plight, 
He will send his armies against them. With his own stronghold unguarded, Botana will be an easy target for assassination, and Count Orlando with him. But do not think Duke Larg will escape the scourge. His is the easy death to achieve. Amidst the coming chaos, who could say how Duke Larg might meet his end? You're inhuman. You're poisoning people kind of like the way that Kefka do, do did to the people in the, the town. Kind of like that almost. <laughs> you ought rejoice. This will mean an end to war and bloodshed. And with that end, a new beginning. The church's hand shall rule. Such is the will of the people. They clamor for change and end to groveling at highborn heels. The war will end, but not like this. There is another way. I expected you'd say as much. No matter. I'll take you on myself. Barrick. Barich. Barich. I think in the original game he was called Bulk. And yes, he is a machinist with a magic gun. Unfortunately, auto potion doesn't always trigger with um, magic. All of my characters are poisoned. Actually, let me check, make sure. He does have a glacial gun. Oh, yeah. oh he's got some armor too. That might be good to take. But first, we have to get his gun. And you... Nothing worth taking. Nope. Nope. Mm -hmm. Okay. We really just need to focus on bulk. Hmm, sorry, excuse me. Urban. I'm burping on stream, I don't mean to be doing that. Oh yeah, he shot her, that's why. Mm. See, Salve gets rid of poison, right? Oh, that's only like for one character, though. I'm more worried about that mage. That mage is gonna try to blast everybody. Ah, shit, he's doing Fundadja. And he's got a Thunder Rod on him. That 
Oh, this is this is gonna this is gonna hurt. God damn it. Oh good, the auto potion triggered that time. Thank you. <laughs> okay, we need to get rid of the mage right now. Can't. Okay. Saved. Here, just kill everybody else except for both. That's No. God damn it. He doesn't have rays, does he? Nope. Nope. I gotta get Mustadio, and Mustadio is disabled. Damn it.
Oh. Come on. Uh, I need to get that gun off of him. Twenty-eight percent chance. Uh. I, need, I, I need my other ninja. Um, I don't know what Ramsa can do here. Can't sleep. Disable. Can't disable. Mm -hmm. Blind. Blind. Okay, we can do that. And it misses at ninety percent. I need to start you. Okay, now he's turn it up. Do not disable him again. God damn it. Mm. Okay, got his gun. It's one thing done. We start, okay, revive, revive, revive. my armor. And broke a sword. Well, at least he can't use his gun anymore. No. Let's uh, block him so he can't run away. I get the thieving. Hmm, finish him off. Get him. And uh, what do you have? Oh, sure, I'll take Toad.
Actually, they're not that bad off. Uh, actually, no. Yeah, just just wait. We're still trying to steal stuff from them. Oh wait, no, I probably can't do it from there. Give me, give it. We'll do it for the JP. Take it. Finally got the guy's armor. Now we're just gonna get his his hat. I want it. I want his hat. Well, I'm just gonna stand in your way then. Yoink. There we go. Now we can kill. Once you put a stop to this fighting, what then? Are you gonna steal all my clothes? How do you propose to purge Ivalice of her corruption? Her fever will not cease to rage till her festered limbs are cut and seared. Even you must see that now. You have cut away the pure flesh with the bow. There is corruption, yes. But there are also good men in Ivalice. And they are not few. 
There are ways to heal a festered wound without the knife. The poison can be drawn. Pray tell what poultice might draw the nobles from this land. As long as you blight it with your existence, we must bow to your whims. A man alone might know equality. Two men, never. One will ever seek to exploit the other. And I will not be exploited. I will claim your seat and take what is due. Take what is my due. I should think I have at least that right. You think to cure this realm's corruption by becoming part of it? What when another comes to claim your seat? You care not for Ivalice's suffering. You care only for your own. Such righteous words. More, more of a greater pure hypocrisy. Punch. Auto potion. Your attack is notified. No, I was not, not to die like this. Gods, give us haste. I? Plotting against the Duke? Are you mad? Please, my lord, do not make this harder than it must be. We have our orders. Why in the name of all this good would I wish to unseat my liege lord? You ask the very question that vexes me. I am gravely disappointed in you, Sid. Surely you cannot mean that, your grace? I am no turncloak. I am your most loyal man. The proof speaks otherwise. It seems you have been in league with the members of the church, working secretly to see me ousted from my rightful seat. That is absurd. From what lying blackguard did you hear such rever reverie? The information comes from the High Confessor himself. You can imagine his distress upon learning of the plot. Your Grace, the High Confessor deceives you. It is he who schemes in the shadows. The High Confessor? Now there is an august claim. Have you any evidence of this? Twenty and more years of loyal service, and still you require evidence? Words fail me, your grace. As you fail me, I cannot hope to fight a war without your order's forces. Still, it seems I am left no choice. A lamentable situation for us both. Take him from my sight. You summoned your grace. I want you to maintain your contact with Mulond. Once the confessional, confessional rescript is in my hands, Larg is as good as defeated. Fear not, your grace. The High Confessor's mind is most firm on that account. Hmm. He had seemed somewhat indifferent to me. There is another matter as well. I am placing the Order of the Southern Sky under your leadership. Henceforth, you are a knight devout. You grant me honor far beyond my due. I expect I shall not regret it. I place my full and utter confidence in you, 
Delita. You, and you alone. Your Grace. Why, thank you for putting me in the exact spot I wish to be in. Okay. Aha, I can do chicken now. Anything more here? Oh, I did pick up those things. Um... Maybe I should give them... Who should I give that stuff to? That's been magic and speed. This robe. You know what, I'll give that to Mustadio. And... This robe. Okay. Alright, for the best of that. South wall or north wall? I have a choice. Um, I don't know, south wall? Okay, Ramza. Beulf. Mm. I guess I can just go with the same setup I had before, but I'll just do one, one ninja this time. In case there's something I have to steal. I don't think there's anything I have to steal in these, in these fights here. But still, having a ninja is always good. Who are you? How did you breach the fortress? We are not of the northern sky. We come under White Banner to meet with Count Orlando. We must see him at once. So, the Count has visitors. I wager you're the rabble he found to assassinate the Duke. You fools. We hold Orlando in a cell behind these very walls. Not to worry. There's room enough in the dungeons for you and the Count both. They have a ninja. Let's see, we got anything good? Nope. Mm. Oh, I forgot to put armor back on Ramza, dang it. I forgot his armor got busted. Yeah. Do over. <laughs> All right, try again. I don't want Ramza going in with, a, with no armor. That would not be wise.
Wow. I guess he threw a pretty decent sword at me. Uh, he has spellbinders. I gotta watch out for that. So we should take him out first. Alright, let's see. I don't think anybody has anything good here. He does have a crystal helmet. That might be worth taking. Okay, Crystal Helmet is the only thing worth taking. Alright, All right, let's go this way. And hopefully not take too much damage. Actually, you know what? Get, get, get rid of Ninja first. Archer dude's not going to do anything. He's not going to do anything from there, and I can't do anything from here. So we'll just wait a moment. Don't you, don't you steal my stuff. God damn it. You will die because of that. Okay. Manfroy. His name is Manfroy. And we cannot do nothing. A rock? You're actually gonna throw a rock? How amazing. Is that the most damage I can do? Hmm, maybe. Yeah, that does a little bit more.
Okay, these guys are being a little too close to Mustadio here. Which one has the um, helmets? This guy. Okay. I need this guy out of my way. That's a good spot to be in. Oh. For Raynor to be in. Because now I can steal stuff from him. <laughs> and just, just knock him out. Wow, that didn't do as much damage as I thought it would. <laughs> Thank you, that'll make up for the helmet I lost. Oh, does Agrius not have the Shantage on anymore? Oh, she has a vampire cape. God damn it. I need to put the San Shantage back on her. Uh, let's see. Um, what can we do? Yeah, you need some healing.
Revenge. Revenge strike. Yay, we win. We must act quickly if we were to stop this battle. Quickly cast haste. We must move fast. But hey, I got a crystal helmet now. What's happened here? You are unwell. What's wrong? It's only my... my head. I'll be fine. Or not. Yeah. Can you hear me? What ill magic is this? They have befouled the air. A poison extracted from moss fungus spores. Spores? We will become fungus people. Lord Brother? That will be well. I worry only for the Duke. Where is he? Would that I knew. My search has yielded not. Zelbag. Dasadog. I am here. Excellency, are you harmed? Someone! Someone an apothecary at once! I don't think anyone will be. We're all dead, Zalbag. How do you feel, Your Excellency? My head. It is as though it was split in twain. But I do not think it's serious. I just need... Some time. Most unfortunate. What? Uh, uh, what have you done? Nice dog. Be silent, brother. You... You betrayed me. You killed your father to... to gain control of your house. Now you have killed me. Blah. Is this poison your work as well? No. No. It is a gift of those who would see House Beoville take center stage. Why do this? Duke Lorg was slain in battle. It is now left to House Beoville to carry out his wishes. This... you go too far. This dagger... place it among the corpses. They were assassins, sent by the Southern Order. You understand me, yes? Dice dog. Yes, I suppose we'll save. One line down, one to go. Okay, what should we get now? Oop. 
Ah, stone. That's probably a good one to have. And the rest are... Leave as is. Okay. I guess I'll just go with the same. Oh, wait. Three. Alright. Mustadio will be over here. Team Mustadio. I don't remember what this fight is. It's the prize, it's been so long. Da, 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 da. Oh, this is the dam. Okay. I think I remember this. Of course, the sluice. With the sluice open, the lake's waters will flood everything downstream. Battle will be impossible. Yay, water. All you have to do is open the sluice and win. Okay, real quick, anybody have anything good that I might want to take? Oh, he's got a Lambert hat. Another crystal helmet and a crystal shield. Another Artemis bow. Okay, we got, got some stuff here. Another crystal helmet. Hey, you got nothing. You got nothing. And you have an axe. Alright, so... You have nothing. Okay, so basically these guys up here have stuff I want. Okay. you to attack. And I can't shoot bow up. You fucking dare do that. There should be a lever at either end of the sluice. Pull both levers and the sluice will open. Now to reach them without getting killed. I'm telling you, player, so you know what to do. So let's, uh... Let's just focus on killing people and stealing stuff for now.
Oh, yes, Arnold. We'll get, we'll get, like, really close. Let's see. Where should I put this? Okay, that actually was helpful, I think. Or maybe it doesn't make any difference because my ninja gets to move again. Oh wait, you're the dude with the uh, thing, right? Oh, you're the one with the hat I want. I need the hat. I can't steal. Dang it. Dang it. Hmm. Just throw something. Damn it. I hate it when they break my stuff. So I have to get a crystal shield now to make up for that. Okay, you got you got nothing for me. I sure about both of my ninjas. Oh well. If I recall correctly, these two dudes on um, the sluice do not move. So we can, we can just kind of mess with them a bit. Be a chicken. Just ignore this guy for now, because he's not going to do anything. Stupid chair, please. Stop. Stop unlocking. Okay, I don't really know if I really need to go out of my way to get his bow. I don't really use archers that often anyway, so... I think I may decide just to get rid of this guy. And miss. No auto potion that time. Do you have anything I need? Or you... You are expendable. Okay, we can go with you. Oh, 
Okay, so the dude is chickens. He has a crystal helmet. We may or may not necessarily need, but... Why fight when you can be a chicken? Well, this is the point in the fight where we just kind of stand around and not do much. Hey, what did you take? No, oh, it actually probably wasn't anything good. This mage. <laughs> Maybe I should just get rid of the mage. I know he has a hat, but he's kind of being a pain in the ass. It's more worthwhile for me to get the crystal armor stuff. Oh wait, he blasts me, he might blast a gen the chicken dude. Dang it. Stupid ninja. I mean mage. I'm sorry, but you have to go. You are a problem. Chicken, you're in the wrong spot. I can't steal from you when you're right there. Dang it. I need you to move. I need you to go faster. Faster. Try to at least get the shield. Okay, that that's a good spot to be in. Okay. 
Okay, got the sheet holder. We need a crystal helmet. Let's see if I can get like one more crystal helmet here. I don't think I probably need to go out on the way to get the real one. Give me all the abilities. Yes, I'll take concentration. I don't. I don't know if that's gonna help with um, Beowulf's um, door skills, but may maybe it won't. I don't know. I got a mage power glove. No, damn it. Chicken, please. Give me, give me the helmets. Agrius is here waiting and like, what are we doing? Just, just get on with it. Chicken, please. Just give me the helmet. Nope, he's back. Ancelot. Ninja go fast. Ninja go very fast. Hmm. All right, you. All right, I think I'm just gonna get rid of you. Spending enough time on this fight. Give me, give me. 
There we go, finally. <laughs> Would you like to be a chicken again? We are done with you. First lever. Here it goes. Nobody to stop me. Once the other lever is pulled, the sluice should open. Can Beowulf do it? Oh, wait, no, I guess Ramza has to do it. Okay. Get out of the way, Beowulf. Only the, only the protagonist can do this. This should do it. Bonk. Congratulations. And now you get the real prize. Down Orlando, we've come. I pray you've kept well, my lord. Well enough, as you can see, they put me in this room full of boxes and crates. Lots of food in here. I could survive in here for decades. And this must be Ramza. How you've grown, boy. Still, I recognize you at once. Have we met, Excellency? Ex Excellency? Yeah. Yes, though I can't say I'm surprised you've forgotten. You were only a child of some three or four years old at the time. You gave us all quite a fright, trying to lift my sword. Your father gave you a scolding that left you in tears. At least you weren't hurt. Ha 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 And now, here you've come to rescue me. I thank you. There's no need to kneel. The battle is ended, with only light casualties on either side. This, too, thanks to the help of Ramza and his companions. We managed to hold the fires of war at bay, for a time. I see. You are a worthy son of Bar- Yeah. You are a worthy son of Barbanef, young Ramza. 
There are many who owe you their thanks, and I give it now in their stead, and mine with it, to be sure. I do only what needs be done. I see to your likeness to Barbanef as more than deep, more than skin deep. Your deeds honor him, boy. I forgive my interruption, but Duke Gotana means to execute your excellency on the morrow. We should waste no time in fleeing. It is as she says, my lord. We should continue this elsewhere. Yes, yes. It won't do for me to remain here with Gotana in his ill temper. Oren, the hour of this war's end will not be long in coming. Until it does, I mean to travel with Ramza. We must put a stop to the High Confessor's plans. Then I will go with you, my lord. No. You will return to Zeltania and see to the safety of Lady Obelia. She alone is the rightful heir to the throne. You must see that she comes to no, comes to no harm. I understand. Well, Ramza, you've no objections, I trust. Not at all, my lord. Let's away before we're found. Bid. With Excalibur. And my party's... Oh, god. Eh. Okay. I cannot, dis <laughs> I cannot dismiss myself. <laughs> I'm sorry, Rams, that we're kicking you out. It is now the saga of Sid now. Your story is done. <laughs> uh, okay, hold on. Alright. I'm sorry, chicken, you have to go. No more chickens. Now that I've had now that I have a Sid, I have practically won the game. How has the sluice been opened? I suffer a plague of fools. You called for me, Ex Excellency. You are to gather a company of soldiers and move against the northern sky at once. The water from the sluice makes movement difficult enough, let alone fighting. But sauce for the goose is sauce for the gander. This is an opportunity we cannot let pass. They will not be expecting an attack. If they slip away now, who can say how long this war may drag on? I must refuse. Refuse? How dare you? No man would wish to see you, King. Yeah. Come. Know that your death is not in vain. The vanity would be in living, and Saint Ajora calls me to his side. Ugh. The real Count Orlando has escaped with Ramza. And we can but hope that Ramza does not fail us. I confess her Marcel came forward with his offer to mediate a peace between the camps. But though their leaders had been lost, their capacity to make war had not. The High Confessor's offer fell on deaf ears. I made for Limberry, for Alma.
And thus both the lions are now dead. And the war has technically come to an end. But Ramza's quest is not yet over. Terminus, Salgidos, okay. Okay, so we're pretty much at the two-hour mark, so I'll probably stop here, because that's probably a good place to stop. Uh, anyway, we have a... we have... We have Sid now. Sid is, like, the most op character you can get in the game. <laughs> I meant what I said. I have Sid now. I have practically won the game now. Because he will... he, he can wreck pretty much everything in the game. He can learn all the sword skills, well, except for the ones that Beowulf has, but... Yeah, he, he, he can wreck most enemies pretty easily. And he comes with the Excalibur Sword, which is actually super op as well. The true heir to the throne can wield this legendary knight sword. It gives you haste and boost holy power and absorbs holy, so. Very powerful. And he already comes equipped with crystal equipment. So. He's pretty, uh. well. Give you a crystal helmet. Oh yeah, she's the Chantage. There we go. I don't know why she uh, unequipped that. Um, yeah, okay, so that's probably where we're going to be at for a night. And I will continue next week. Hopefully I'll build up um, Stood and Beowulf a little better here. By the time I rejoin. So. Yay, I need to uh, save. Level 40. Yeah, we're getting close to the end here. I don't know how many more parts there will be here. We'll do the, uh, the stuff to Linberry next, I in the next part, I think. And do a lot more feeding. And then after that, I don't quite remember what happens after that in the game, so... Chapter 4 is... The, my, my memories of Chapter Four, of, Chapter Four's events are very hazy. Like I remember what happens, I just don't remember what order everything happens in. <laughs> it's like, oh, okay, now, okay, now we're going to Limberry to fight Elmdor. So, that was, but that was his name, the Duke of Limberry, the kind of a vampire dude. So anyway, so maybe we'll be doing that next time. Okay. That was... I hope that was entertaining. Anyway. Fun game. It's getting getting closer to the end here. And I already have plans on what game to be streaming after this. Oh yes. I know what's coming after this. <laughs> anyway. That'll be it for tonight. Thanks for watching. Have a good night. And take care.